Hello everybody, I am Nico D. So today I'm gonna show you DOS box on the Oldroid N2 Plus. So the Oldroid N2 Plus has the best single core performance of any ARM SBC. So DOS box really runs well on it. Almost all DOS games of the past run great on it. There's just a limit of some games that don't run perfect, but almost all others run great on it. I love those games, I grew up with them, so I love to be able to play these games. Do you know all these games are played without any GPU drivers? Some could perform a lot better with GPU drivers. This is just with Armbian, so this is a new version of Armbian for the Oldroid N2+. Download link here in the description. Everything I do here is the same for Ubuntu from Oldroid or for any other Linux distro. So first of all, of course, we need to install DOSBox. So for that type, sudo apt install DOSBox. So the next thing we do is we run DOSBox one time and then we close it again. Then in our user directory, we set show hidden files on. Then we see the folder .dosbox. We open that folder. There is a configuration file of DOSBox. So set it all like I do it here. So the full resolution and the window resolution I set to 1024 by 768. The output I set to overlay. Then here I am using a UK keyboard, so I do keyboards UK and I set the mount pad for my DOS folder. And I save that. And now there is one more thing we have to do. So set the display resolution for the operating system itself. So if we start DOSBox right now, then we will not have a full screen. So for that we set the display resolution. So I use again Genie. In Armbian we still use boot.ini for this. In Ubuntu or most other Linux distros for the Oldroid N2 Plus, it is config.ini. So here also set the display resolution to 1024 by 768. Save it and reboot. It is also very important that we set our governor to performance, otherwise DOSBox will perform very bad. So to do that we can again use Genie and we open etc slash default slash CPU frag utils. There we set the governor to performance and again save that and reboot. So now you are booted in 1024 by 768. This is only necessary for the old roids. This is because you cannot set the display resolution and the OS itself. With any other SBC you do not have to do it like this. So now we can play our DOS games full screen. So let's go to the first game. Of course, Prince of Persia.
การそう、all the old 2D DOS games run great on the Android N2 Plus. Even the early 3D games run great on it. So here is Doom. Runs perfectly.
Ready. Fight. Fight. You win. You win. A game that doesn't run perfect is Duke Nukem 3D. It is playable. You do get a better frame rate when you decrease the screen size. I'm playing it on a big 4K display, so even when it is decreased of size, it still looks okay and big enough to play. And now a little benchmark, so this game shows what CPU it thinks you've got. So when clocked at 2.4 GHz, it thinks it is a 486 at 176 MHz. That never existed, but that doesn't matter. So when you put the clocks to 1.5 GHz, like the default clock of the Raspberry Pi, then you get a 107 MHz 486. And with the clocks at 2 GHz, you get 149 MHz 486. So this is what the Raspberry Pi can do, and also the Oldroid N2. So the N2 Plus is quite a bit more powerful in DOSBox. So that's it for today, I hope you all liked my video. Please subscribe to my channel, thank you all for watching, see you all later, bye!